Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be talking about the 1995 film Margaret's Museum. Margaret's Museum is probably one of the most beautiful films I've ever seen. It's set in a mining village in Canada just after the Second World War. And Margaret meets Neil. And to begin with, it's kind of obvious where it's going to go. I mean, if you look at the back of the DVD box, it's pretty obvious where the relationship is going to go. And it does that very, very quickly. And they are married in a very short space of time, despite the fact that at first you don't think they're going to be. But once they're married, things start to take a little bit of a different turn. Their life's not as happy as they thought it was going to be. And then Neil decides to go back down the mines. And obviously that causes a bit of an issue. And it's, it's quite an emotional story of the tragedies that families have to go to when people are working in the mines. And it's very emotional. It's, it's not what I expected it to be about. I mean, looking at that, that is not what I thought this was going to be about. I don't really know what I thought it was going to be about, but that wasn't it. However, it is one of the most beautiful stories ever, and without giving it away, I just want to say the ending was just what. So if, if you're watching it thinking, oh, this is really cliche, I know how it's going to end, chances are you don't. It's so insane, and it's it just doesn't fit in with the rest of the film, and that makes it beautiful. Um, it is a 15 certificate, there is strong language, Helena is naked at one point, it's absolutely brilliant, really gorgeous film. So do check it out. What makes this stand out above any other film, because it's not completely unique in concept, there are similar films, I think is the characters. Um, Margaret is a character, is really likeable, she's quite feisty, she has a lot of opinion, but at the same time she does have her vulnerable side, and, and Neil kind of helps bring that out a bit. Neil has Scottish ancestry, me being Scottish, I love that. He plays the bagpipes. So for the, the, the soundtrack for this, you have a lot of Scottish music, a lot of folk music, and it's just absolutely beautiful. I think there's a picture on the back of him. This particular scene is beautiful. So the soundtrack for it is great. Right from the start, it's an hour and 30 minutes, and right from the start, you just have this really beautiful, soulful, Celtic music. And when you're combining that with the scenery and, it's just, and the emotions, it's just, it's heartbreaking. Obviously the reason that I decided to watch this was because of Helena, obviously I absolutely love her and I didn't think this was going to be one of my favourite Helena roles. It absolutely is. I think she plays the character expertly. Um, there are, it's, it seems like quite a hard character to play to capture the essence right, especially with what happens at the end. But she does it just spot on and it's so beautiful and it's probably now, Mar Margaret McNeil is probably now one of my favourite of Helena's roles. The film's directed by Mort Ranson and there are so many beautiful scenes in this. It, the contrasting with the beautiful nature and you have the scenes under the mines, it's, um, it's, it's done very, very well. It's done tastefully as well. It's, it, obviously this is something that a lot of people will get personal stories from. For me, I don't, I, as far as I'm aware, I have no ancestry who worked in the mines or if they did, I'm not aware of that. But this is something that will touch a lot of people on a personal note. For me, it touched me because of Helena, but it, it is so, such a gorgeous, gorgeous film. If you watch only one film in the foreseeable future, please, please, please make it Margaret's Museum. Uh, I got this from Amazon, I think. I might have got it from like a second, like a, a CEX or something. It is on Amazon though, it definitely is on Amazon and it's not too expensive, so do try and get hold of it. Um, as I said, it is a 15 certificate, so please watch out for that. But let me know your thoughts on Margaret's Museum and I'll see you all next time. Bye.